So I wanna show you how to do a taping for those 11s, and this is gonna be a night taping. So those fun 11s, those vertical lines that we get, let's see if we can get some improvement on those. So you're gonna take your tape, and the measurement that you're gonna do is you're gonna measure from the arch of your eyebrow to the middle, kind of where your third eye would be between the eyebrows, all right? So you're gonna measure from here to here, right? Now I, and then you're just gonna cut that amount of tape off. I've already done that for our purposes. So again, from here to here is what it's gonna look like. Now, once you have your tape, you're going to then cut it in half. So you're just gonna fold your tape lengthwise and cut it in half. Oops. So then you're going to have two pieces. Then you're going to take each of these pieces and again, lengthwise, cut them in half. So you will end up with four pieces, right? Now you'll notice on these four pieces, they have very square edges. For the length taping, it's okay, but for the night taping, we wanna round those edges because these corners, they tend to kind of girth up a little bit. So how you're going to do that is you're just going to take your tape and you're literally just taking those corners off. I mean, it's really easy. You're just kind of rounding them, right? So it looks like that. And you'll do that on all of the corners. And I've already done that for our purposes here. So these are your finalized four. This is what yours will look like. Now to apply, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take one of them and I'm just gonna rip the tape off the back. And again, the tape is really stretchy. So just don't be shy, get aggressive and rip that backing off. So we're going to start with the high, you know, kind of the arch of the eyebrow. And we're just gonna put the tape on just like that. Now we're not stretching the tape. Remember, we're just gonna stretch the skin. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna hold and anchor my position here, and then I'm gonna pull out. And I'm simply going to put the tape on like that. So I didn't stretch the tape at all, but I did stretch my skin. All right, so it'll look like this. And then we're gonna do the other side. Again, I'm going at the arch of my eyebrow. Looks like this. Remove the tape. I'm gonna anchor with my finger and I'm gonna pull out. Whoops. And then I'm just going to make sure, and you know, just kind of press onto that tape to make sure that it's nice and adhered. So this is what your taping for the 11s are gonna look like, right? Now, if you are under 40, you're good to go. You can just go to sleep, take it off in the morning and you're all set. For those of us way over 40, definitely over 40, um, this is not enough to really stabilize that corrugator muscle. So we have to double up. So that's what your extra pieces are for. So we're gonna repeat the same thing that we just did, just with another layer. So what I'm gonna do with this, I'm gonna start in the same position, but when I set my anchor, I'm covering half of the tape, the previous tape. And again, I'm gonna pull out, right? So you can see part of the tape under there. I'm just trying to reinforce this. So by pulling it out, what that does is it stretches those muscles under there will make it so that they can't come together when we're sleeping. I'm gonna do the same thing. Yep. Oops. Remove the backing. Whoops. And then again, we're gonna anchor and pull the skin, not the tape. So this is what it's going to end up looking like that, or looking like, excuse me. And then you'll just go to sleep. It's really simple. And in the morning, when you take off your tape, you will actually see a decrease in those 11s, which is great. So give this a try. It's a really easy kind of starting beginner type tape and see how you go.